Hello, this is Mr. Bone, aka the Icon. Um, I actually got some outstanding news. I got me a job. I got me a wife. I mean, I mean, I know the past videos. I mean, depressed and all that shit. But you know, it is funny how God works, man. Because you know, God works when God try to change you. It's never easy. Trust me. I mean, but. It, it, he leave you in the dark for a while, you know. And I was listening to Moody. Uh, I forgot the pastor's name. It was uh, Von Moody. That's his name, Von Moody. And then he was with T.D. Jake. They was doing a sit down about relationships and shit. You know what I'm saying? And I didn't know well, in my past relationship. I did not know the dark times was coming because I was living in a fantasy world where she was using me, but I was living in the fancy world and hoping things was okay but whole time was not okay when somebody is cheating on you with somebody else so it's like i was living the whole fantasy world and then when that really came to fruition you know i lived in the dark times i'm talking about i lost the girl i thought i loved the family i thought i had um i thought i lost my job i lost everything and i until i lost everything and then you know i cried because i was i lost i was crying i was crying because i lost everything but i didn't i didn't know i didn't know that god was was molding me to something better you know it, it better in life he was molding me into like you know you you for the, for the I, he said you know God got a plan for you. His plan might not see it your way. It's gonna be your way, but it's gonna be he gonna work it to your advantage. But you cannot see it. I'm talking about, you know, back in August, the, me and the girl broke up. You know what I'm saying? I think August. But back in August, me and the girl broke up. So I've been single for already up to basically damn it now. So then I got a job at the same time. I got a good wife. Um, got a good job and whole time you know only time only reason i'm home because the situations of, of my family family related you know or i'll be in the truck but it's family related and they say i can come back in july you know what i'm saying because you know he said, technically you ain't hard technically you can go, go back he said you still got a job and it's really cool because i've been in this job before and, I, and at first i didn't like it you know what i'm saying and I, I didn't like it at first and then i quit and then when I came back, everybody remembered me. Oh, how you doing, Mr. Rowe? And I only did a month. How you doing, Mr. Rowe? You're such a good worker. How you doing? I'm so happy you're back. Welcome back. You know what I'm saying? So it's like the the, the job loved me. You know what I'm saying? I got a, a wife. The wife actually loved me. And it's like she's different. And then I, in so many ways, instead of like finding faults in me, she find my good qualities and all this shit. You know what I'm saying? Even when I get angry, she find the good qualities. So you got more to live for it. All this shit, I said, and I tell her, I said, I've never had that in a woman before. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, it's amazing. You know what I'm saying? It's amazing how you find them. It's amazing how you find a good woman. It's amazing. And the reason why I say that before, because I'm a man, and I've been single for damn near a year. I've been single for damn near a year. And I'm so happy that we find uh we in the darkness I grew. I got closer to God, you know what I'm saying? Then I found, you know, the last girl, she was an atheist, she didn't believe in God. But the girl I found now, let me turn this around. But the girl I found now is that uh she believed in God. You know, every day she she just said a lot of shit. A lot of shit. And then it was like it's it's, 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 my, my, my dad asked me a question, man. He said, what you like about this girl? And I couldn't answer it. And my girl got mad. Like, dad, you can't really answer the question. I said, it's so much that I like about you that you actually got a career. You actually want to do so in your life. And then besides everybody else didn't want to do shit. You know what I'm saying? And then no matter how hard I tried, it's like they didn't want to do shit. And you... You know, or you hook, I put them on a job where they would quit or they would just find some excuse. And, and when 
like you actually like really want to do something and it's like when you have that and plus it's your own ambitions it's nothing but nothing but great you know what i'm saying i the the outcome and i know god ain't through with me yet but the outcome of what god you know how you be in the dark i can't explain it's hard for me to explain it because you know um you be in the dark for so long and you think like damn this is it's getting worse and all this shit the devil that's when the devil start throwing stones on top of he was throwing pebbles at first and you ain't see the pebbles and the devil get to throwing stones and the stones get to beating and breaking your bones and all that shit now next thing you know god come on with the sun then it's like that Jill Scott me the Angie Stone song is no more rain and cloud. Like, damn. Like, my heart is filled with pure joy. You know what I'm saying? And then, but I have to get through that hurt. I had to let go of that hurt and go through all the things of the hurt. Because I bet, like, all these YouTube videos, you could tell I was crying. And, well, I was crying, I was crying and complaining a lot. But now you found somebody, it's different. That's what I said. In, in dark times where God changed you, you can't, you can't, like, deceive me. And I, every time I have my head, I'm like, I know, God, you got something better for me. I know you got something better for me. I know you got better, something better for me. And then to find out, he, he gave me a wife. You know what I'm saying? Not no somebody I could date. Somebody I could look at, like, I could marry you. You know what I'm saying? He said, like, for once, like, I could say that. You know what I'm saying? I would say that in the past, but I could marry you. Then also they do something like fuck up some money bad or do something. I had something I could invest in, you know what I'm saying? Because everything, a relationship is an investment. I said, you know, and I ain't going to say they bad people. I just said, like, you know, everybody is there for somebody. You know what I'm saying? Everybody there for somebody. And they was not there for me. You know what I'm saying? So when I, I need, I need, I need the help. They was not there. And then I, I'm broke right now, and she just accepted me. With, I got an ankle monster, and she, she, she there to accept, you know, my my past. She, she just loved me for me. It's, it's kind of hard to find somebody that loves you for me. You know, the last person I had talking about I love you because you got something. You know what I'm saying? No, that's not for me. You know what I'm saying? You you love me because the money I could bring in. You know what I'm saying? This girl got her own shit. She was I don't need you for shit. I said, you know what? That's the type of relationship I'm talking about. Because I used to tell my girls, I don't need you for shit. I got my own money. You know what I'm saying? And then if we both don't need each other, you know what I'm saying? Then we gonna need each other. Because we go, we go, I know you got it and you know I got it. You know what I'm saying? So all the bullshit aside, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't date to get the date I date to get married, you know what I'm saying? And then when God put this on my foundation, like, man, now you you ready to do something. I've been single for damn near a year. I was working on me, developing me. And once I developed me, God saw he developed me, he brought somebody in my life, man. I mean that but I, I, I it's hard to talk about a dark period because the dark period is dark. I mean I'm talking about it's dark. You can see it, the light could, it, the sun could be outside and it seems like it's midnight to you. You know what I'm saying? And it's like everything happens for a reason you know what i'm saying how she left me it happens for a reason she she needed got my life you know what i'm saying uh, uh the job needed got my life because i was too distracted you know what i'm saying now that you know situations get done and all this shit get done and i, and I want to go back to my job me and my girl you're gonna see like i told you in five in seven years you're gonna see be being rich and I got a queen by my side. I don't got no little girl that wanna be called princess or all stupid shit. You know what I'm saying? I got a queen by my side. I said, You my queen, you my wife, you my heart. You know what I'm saying? She said, Yeah, I'm the queen. You know what I'm saying? Fuck all the dumb shit. I'm the king, you the queen. Jay Z Beyonce status. I can't take care of no fucking princess. You know what I'm saying? That's your grown ass woman and you got princesses too. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I can't do it. You know what I'm saying? That's that's too much weight on me. And my growth, man. My growth, man, is so it's so big now. Like, that's like I'm married, you know what I'm saying? And this it is it is I'm happy, bro. I on some real shit. Like I don't know what to say. It's just the happiness, it's like it definitely puts you in tears happiness, you know what I'm saying? If you ever had that. It's just the happiness that puts you in tears. You just can't I can't believe all this is happening to me, happiness. But I'm going to edit it off right now, but you know, God bless you.